So this is Fletcher. Fletcher is a lovely dog. He is very pleasant. He loves everybody. He's very calm. Here you see him at doggy daycare. He is great with all the dogs. Doesn't mind any of them. Big dogs, little dogs. He loves to play with the doodles that come, of course. They always seem to like their own kind. But he really enjoys being there with everyone. In this segment, Regan is going to demo Fletcher's sit and his down and then his stand command. She is using food, wants to make sure that he's going to do it for the video, but actually he's doing a lot of it without food now. He can get a little distracted, but he always comes back to work. He has some fun tricks that he's learned. He knows spin and circle. He has a sit up. Oops, he's almost going to fall down. He also has a rollover, which I think she's going to show you next. He's a cutie pie. Really smart, really easy to train. In this segment, you're going to see Fletcher's settle command. So it's like a, it looks like a play dead, but what we use it for is to have them lie on their side and calmly accept handling. So you should be able to look at their eyes, look at their ears, their teeth, their paws. You should actually be able to do their toenails in this position. He's perfectly accepting of all the handling, very used to it. This is a touch command, simply getting him to move towards a hand, um, giving him a touch command, or you can change it to a say hello later on. Uh, it's just a way to get him to move around without a lure or food. So Fletcher has a pretty nice weight at this point. Um, obviously, you know, you're going to continue to work on this, um, get him to learn to stay longer and go further away. But she gives him the weight command, she walks away, or, you know, backs up, and then she'll give him a weight command and she'll actually release him so that he can come to her. So you can do it both ways, he needs to practice it both ways, so you can work either way. In this segment, you're just going to see him walk with Regan, uh, just follow me, come with me, that's the beginning of being able to walk on a leash. He certainly doesn't mind this game at all. He thinks it's sort of fun. So in this segment, uh, we have Regan and BJ calling Fletcher back and forth. We simply um, want him to come and be rewarded again and again for coming so that he learns that that's just the best thing to do when he hears his name or he hears the word come. So we do suggest that you continue this. Call him in the yard, give him a treat, call him back and forth in the house, give him a treat. It always involves a treat at this point because this is probably one of the most important behaviors that he will learn. So we always want him to come back. That could be the lifesaver. So we give him a treat for this always and I would always give him a treat for going in the crate. Okay, so in this next clip, it is 11 degrees outside. He does not want to be out here. We wanted to get a little walking on the leash, and which you're going to see very little of it because he was ready to go in. His paws were getting cold. Okay, go ahead. Come on, Fletcher. This is Fletcher getting in his crate. He loves his crate, so it's not a problem at all. He will get in his crate, wait in his crate, behave. And then when she comes back to let him out of the crate, she'll tell him to wait. He can't barge out of the crate. And then she'll release him to come out of the crate. Just overall, this is a great dog. Thank you for letting us train Fletcher.
Uh, this is Fletcher, and he's been staying with me for almost two weeks now. He has been the perfect house guest. Um, he could stay forever if he wanted to. Loves his crate, hasn't had an accident in the house since his second day with me. Um, is very good about going to the door and going outside. Uh, he plays hard, he sleeps harder. Uh, he's just been great, great with the other dogs. He's been going to daycare. He got to go to a lure coursing trial and hang out with the big dogs and did great with everybody he met. He's been around kids, adults, everybody, and he loves everyone. So you're getting a great dog, and he has been fantastic to have. 